Now, I don't know if you guys have heard or seen anything about this possible mold issue when it comes to the Air Jordan 1 Chicago Lost and Found. But, you know, a lot of times when we see things on the internet, you know, kind of, it's hard to believe everything because there's like a lot of trolling and stuff like that out there. And there was some mold issues with some Jordan sneakers, you know, a few months back and stuff like that. And, you know, I hit on the Nike sneakers after the release and it just keeps saying pending shipment. And we're hearing rumors that Nike's canceling orders because of the mold issue and or, you know, they're trying to cancel bought orders and stuff like that. Now, I don't know how true, you know, a lot of the bought orders being canceled is. But this mold issue is 100% real and I have proof of it for you today. Now before we dive right into this topic, I do want to just take a quick second out to wish you all, you know, a very happy Thanksgiving, you know, enjoy this time with your family, you know, think about the things that you are thankful for. Uh, for me right now, I'm thankful for all you guys that always show up to my videos, you know, and been supporting me, you know, video in, video out, you know, hitting that like button, comment, all that stuff, you know, DMing me on Instagram, you know what I mean? Like I've met a lot of cool people just, you know, posting videos on YouTube. So, you know, I am thankful, you know, to you guys and a bunch of other things in my life, but you know what I mean? just happy thanksgiving and make sure to spend this time with your loved ones now getting into today's topic right so um i keep looking on the nike sneakers app you know seeing if my lost and found shipped out and it just keeps saying pending shipment which you know what i mean it's kind of to be expected i mean there was a lot of pairs that you know were released and stuff like that they also had a shock drop for the jordan 11 cherries which a lot of people still have not seen those pairs ship out yet i was lucky i did get my pair in already um but you know uh they're sort of behind right now they dropped a lot of heat and a lot of pairs and it looks like they're a little bit behind but we have come across an issue uh with the mold on the lost and founds now at first when i originally saw it i really wasn't sure if it was real because like the post that i saw kind of just looked like it was sort of like photoshopped it didn't really look all that good the quality wasn't good and um you know what i mean i was just hoping for the best now because my pair you know hasn't shipped out yet i was sort of like kind of worrying just a little bit because you know we're hearing about nike canceling orders um because you know trying to prevent you know the botters from getting the pairs or whatever which i don't really necessarily believe but this mold issue does seem to be 100 percent legit now my homie your average sneaker guy he is a youtuber definitely go check him out he got his pair today in from the nike sneakers app and he sent me a bunch of images of them and i'm going to show them to you guys so you can you know take a look at them now i'm pulling them up on my phone so that uh you know it looks like in the first photo i mean it just looks like there's some mold inside the sock liner you know something that really wouldn't be considered like that big of a deal you know what i mean but it just looks like a little bit of dirt now in the second photo you can see a big mold right there and he even like circled them um you know on top of the the top of the sneaker right there with that cracked leather where they're trying to make it look aged there's mold there and then there's mold um below the jordan wings logo and I mean, it's really bad, man. Like that is really bad to have that much mold. It's also on the other side of the sock liner on the inner part as well. And some of you guys might not think like that's that big of a deal, but it really kind of is because that means that those were sitting for a long time. They weren't treated properly. And you know, mold on sneakers. I mean, you really can't like really wear that sneaker. I mean, you can probably clean some of it off, but uh, this mold issue seems to be like a real problem, you know, just thinking about what was coming out the other day and some of the images and some of the rumors like, you know, it might be like one or two pairs, but Nike's QC has been like really bad over the past couple of years. You know what I mean? And I understand like mistakes happen, but like somebody actually looked at that pair of sneakers, you know, saw mold on it and then shipped it out. Like mistakes happen, you know what I mean? But guys, it's very, 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 very possible. And I am scared to death of even thinking that this is a possibility but you know it was hard enough to cop the sneaker on the nike sneakers app when it dropped and the fact that you caught a w right now guys like we run the risk of possibly having our orders canceled if they haven't already shipped out yet for this mold issue so definitely if your sneaker does ship out make sure when it comes you're inspecting it like really really well um because you know this is my homie right here you know what i mean and i feel bad for him you know what i mean because these sneakers were really hard to get they're really really hyped you know what i mean and i don't know like even if he sent it back to nike they're not going to send him another pair because they probably don't have another pair you know what i'm saying so um yeah i mean he could get his money back but then he's out to lost and found so guys um 
you know, just, you know, when you do get your pairs in, if they do ship out, hopefully your pairs isn't canceled. You know what I mean? And, uh, but when they do come, definitely check into this because this mold issue looks like it's a hundred percent real, which sucks. <laughs> you know what I mean? If this release couldn't get any more crazier, now we got mold issues. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. <laughs> Comment down below, uh, you know what I mean, with your thoughts, you know, about this whole thing with the mold and the whole, you know, Air Jordan 1 Lost and Found release. But guys, happy Thanksgiving to you. I will see you guys very, very soon. Uh, make sure to spend this time with your friends and family. Don't take it for granted. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. I'm out. Peace. For more sneaker content, make sure you hit that subscribe button and you hit that notification bell so you never miss a video.